We are about seven months out from Election Day tonight, and the man that a lot of Republicans want to see take on Governor Cuomo brought his campaign to Buffalo today. Dutchess County Executive Mark Molinaro came out here on his tour of stops across the state after announcing his candidacy on Monday. He has an uphill battle ahead. In the latest Siena poll, 77% of voters didn't know who he was or don't have an opinion of him. And he was almost 30 points behind Cuomo in a head-to-head -head matchup. We asked him what he wants to do differently in Albany. What specifically are you prepared to do to do away with four men in a room and a select few making decisions behind closed doors? Well, stop meeting with four men in a room. I mean, the governor sets the tone, and he or she can choose who he or she wishes to meet with. And I, I think the first, uh, the first place to start is to ensure that you're negotiating with members of the legislature, empowering local elected officials and involving resident citizens in decision making, uh, holding ourselves uh, uh, more accountable, imp imposing term limits. I've already said that I'd hold myself to two, uh, four your terms and I'd seek a constitutional amendment to ensure that uh, statewide elected officials could not serve more than two consecutive terms and that members of the Molinaro had a lot more to say. We've posted his whole question and answer session from today on WGRZ.com. Molinaro and State Senator John DeFrancisco are competing for the GOP nomination. Party leaders are expected to choose a candidate next month.